Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I um, realized that I haven't done an update in like 11 months when I checked all my videos on YouTube. And it's just been a really like eventful year. I've been studying, I've been working, I've been doing all kinds of stuff. And today I just wanted to do a quick, really quick brief update. What's been going on with my laser surgery? And um, the thing is, my right eye didn't really turn out that well after the touch-up surgery. And today we're going in for a second touch-up surgery. So that's why I wanted to do a brief update because I'm going in today here in Stockholm, still the same clinic. I know I mentioned that I really didn't, I wasn't sure if I wanted to do the surgery in the same clinic anymore, if they were willing to, but I had a talk with them two weeks ago and they're really positive. They're really like thinking that just scraping off the final haze that is left in the eye will probably make it a huge difference. So if you guys haven't seen my previous videos on this story, you can check out the rest of them on my channel or I can link it up here somewhere. Um, and they kind of, I go into detail on what my story has been ever since I started with the surgeries. Only like I initially thought that I would just do it once and then my eyesight would be perfect like everyone is usually talking about. But uh, that was not the case for me. So I've been trying to document my story and my experience. So this is just a little bit of a shaky video today just because I just wanted to get it up ASAP just to get this information out. Just some quick notes on what I've been doing to prepare for this touch-up surgery. I've been throughout these years I've been reading up a lot about like what you could do to prevent haze and what to do to kind of like um, have like better healing process. Um, so I've been prepping for a week now. Uh, for seven days I've been taking 500 milligrams of vitamin C every day um, and I'm thinking about increasing that to one gram a day from today. So I'm going to be taking one of those like tablets that you put in water um, every day and I will also be increasing the amount of fruits, fruits and vegetables that I'm taking in every day into my diet, uh, especially blueberries and those kind of fruits that have a lot of antioxidants. So that is my plan for this time around. I know that I've been, the only thing I've been following before is to eat a vegetarian diet, but also including vitamin C but I haven't been thinking about the antioxidant level of my food. So I've been trying to like stock up on a lot of these fruits and vegetables to put in my smoothies and also just eat it fresh because that is always the best way to get them in your diet. One item that has the most antioxidant level out of everything is hibiscus tea. So I'm trying to drink that every day. Okay, so I'm going to cut it off here and I'll catch you guys later when I'm going to do updates on this uh, touch-up surgery. Bye for now. Take care.